doom 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 It's do my vape review. Hey, what up, y'all? Say hello, Mr. Four Eye. <laughs> yep, I've got glasses since the last review that I've done. Uh, I don't mind them. I think they're cool. Uh, I'm used to kind of wearing one contact on this side, but that's all right. I've gotten compliments on them. People tell me that I look sophisticated, which is always nice. I don't know what y'all think, but I, I think they look good on me. Um, anyway, this is the one and only Do My Dash, and this will be an unboxing video for change. I know most of my videos are reviews. This will be an unboxing video because this is kind of a big news. Well, kind of big news, whatever. Uh, we have MGMT's Electric Feel, this song, Freaking Rocks. Uh, playing in the background. This will be a vaping unboxing, vaping related unboxing. I went to 101vape.com, got me a couple things. Got me a Pro Tank 3 Mini from Kanger Tech. Here it is, and all that shiny goodness. I got a drip tip to go on that uh, Clermizer. I like my uh, Red Ego piece. <laughs> it's all packed and ready to go. <laughs> anyway, uh, my uh, drip tip for my, well, this drip tip. It's a red one. You can probably tell red and black my favorite colors, so there we'll go. Red dip, the drip tip. Got a nice wide hole in the, you know, on the top, standard hole on the bottom. But it, it looks cool. It looks cool. Anyway, now on to the main reason that I am doing this video. Yes, I now am the proud owner of an Inokin I taste. MVP V2 mod. Woohoo! Here it is in the bubble wrap. And here we go unboxing it. As the music plays. There we go. Out of the bubble wrap for your viewing enjoyment. Now let's see. Okay, it's just plastic. It's just plastic, so I'm gonna take the plastic off real quick. Unbox this thing for you. Love this part. Gotta love it, baby. Gotta love it. This song rocks. It kicks ass. Okay, the plastic wrap is off this thing. Now we have Where It's At by Beck. This song has been around a few years, but it's still pretty cool. I like it. We have the other plastic wrap box. And it has the sticker so it's open. Okay, just a second. Stick her off real quick. Move the mouse so I don't go into the dreaded screen tube. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we go, baby. Right. Yeah, I'm not like it. Just clap your hands. Just clap your hands. Taking it out of the box and put it in my hand, I'm not like it. I'm not like it. It's got a natural feel. I'm not gonna push a button. I like the, you know, the variable voltage, variable wattage display. It's cool that whole mirror finish in the in the LED comes through it. 
I've seen plenty of, you know, videos of the MP3, so, or not MP3, MVP. I gotta get my terminology straight. <laughs> MVP. Okay. I taste MVP. Dig the reverse S on the I test. I taste. It's pretty cool. I like that. Uh, back in with the flame and taste it, love it thing. Yeah, baby. I got the black green. It looks cool. It looks cool. And of course, if I wanted to, I could charge my cell phone off the bottom. Which I might just end up doing here sooner or later. I don't know when, but sooner or later. <laughs> but yeah, that was my unboxing of the iTaste MVP V2. I will go ahead and come back once I've vaped on this thing a little bit, give you my opinions, and, you know, just kind of go from there. So, that's it for now, but that is not the end of this video. And after over a month, I'm back. <laughs> I know, um, I know it's been forever since I unboxed my MVP, but at least that should give me a pretty good basis on reviewing this thing accurately and telling out what I think of it. For review, this is my MVP right now with the i30 tank, Blue Meister tank that was supplied with it. I like the tip of the tank, how it's, you know, I can angle it 360 degrees right here. You can go right here, you know, just like that. I like to, you know, point it at me so where I, you know, when I take the bait, you know, it's right there. Uh, I like the MVT, MVP, I really do. I really do. It's a great little mod. My first uh, mod, you know, to replace my Eagle battery that I had in my first two vaping videos. It's really, it's really good, really good. Have the iTaste logo the e on the front, and of course the Taste It Loving on the back. I probably already showed that to you in the first half of this video, but I did. Too bad. <laughs> um, but yeah, I really like the MVP. It fits pretty well in my hand, as you can see. I can hold it either way, you know, there's a button right here, hold it like this. Make it, you know, hit the button. It's got a good throwing button. It's not hurt at all to fire. Uh, let's take a vape real quick. Baby. <laughs> um, yeah. The i 30 tank that came with the MVP, I have to say, some people like like this tank and some people could do without it. I'm in the people that, you know, I'm in the camp with the people that like the tank. It gives really good flavor. Uh, it's a dual coil tank, but it's top coil. I don't know if you can see the, the you know, the two coils, the juice. Uh, it's, I like to say it has tentacles. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, good flavor. Has a nice, uh, you know, like I said, nice tip on it. 360 degree rotation on the tip. It's nice. Um, paper production. It's pretty good. When I first started using the tank, uh, I thought the draw was a little bit tight and it wasn't putting out, or at least I didn't think it was putting out as much vapor as I was used to with my T3S tanks, but it's gotten better as I've been using it. Uh, the juice in the tank is Throwback Cherry Cola from, I believe, OKC Vapes. I got it from another shop. The great e vape here in Amarillo. It's right up the street from where I live. Actually, it's kind of in between where I live and where I work, so that's kind of cool. It's, you know, pretty good, pretty good place. I like it anyway. Um, the, uh, 
the display is here. I like it how you know it has a mirror finish, but still, you know, we can hit, hit both buttons on it, you can see it, but yeah, there's the display 2.1 ohms and I believe 3.8 volts. Let me check. 2.1 ohms. Yep, exactly. I'm good. But uh, yeah. Uh, power button, well the power button versus the voltage button, I just stick with watts. I've uh, read some posts on the Electronic Cigarette Forum, which is a great place, great place, to get information about electronic cigarettes and vaping. Uh, I'll go ahead and post a link on my description of this video. But uh, the posts that I've been reading from ECF, uh, you can't really run on both volts and watts, so you have to run either or watts or volts. I run a watts uh, in this coil which is two point run ohms and resistance. I have it on eight and a half watts and it vapes really well. The juice is pretty good too. The throwback cherry cola from OKB OKC vapes really good. Yeah, babe. <laughs> yeah, I'm really getting into vaping. It's it's a great hobby, especially if you're a nicotine fiend like I am. <laughs> and you know you don't want to get into smoking. The smoking kills, we all know. Um, but yeah, that's my kind of conclusion on my NPP version two with the iClear 30 tank. My Mini Pro Tank 3 is working like a boss. Uh, I've got some Red Hot Candy juice in there. Awesome stuff. Anyway, the song is almost over, so I better get to doing my shout outs before the song does over. Does end. <laughs> and just a second. Let me go ahead. There we go. Shout outs for this video include My Teddy 68, DGB 8303, Doug Karung. Karen, Karen, C A R O N, how the heck do you pronounce that? Uh, Marmot Man 30, G Drymy, Drymy, D R A I M E. I know the name, the usernames are hard to pronounce this time. Uh, Skate Don't Hate 96, Zach Brown, I C Wowner, or excuse me, I C W Owner, I guess. Uh, it flows shell or I flow shell and Charles Runyon. Those are my shout outs for this review. And one last view of my MVP2 with the uh, iClear 30 tank. Back, taste it, love it. I'm tasting it and I'm loving it. This has been Do My Dash. I'm out for now. Vape on.